travel nurses who leave their homes to go where they're needed the most. Laura Cotolo and Morgan Fitzsimmons are traveling nurses in Green Bay. Today, they're in the national spotlight. And Morgan Fitzsimmons of Wisconsin. I remember being like slightly hesitant because I'm like, oh, that's kind of, um, okay. I'm like, this is an opportunity that, you know, you don't, that doesn't come across often. You know, I feel like you can't say no. The Bell and Health workers appeared on the Today Show on NBC to talk about their experiences. Laura Cudillo is for originally from Arizona. This month, they also appeared in the New York Times and on CNN. Honestly, it's also by pure circumstance. Like I look at the series of events and it started as our travel company reaching out to us saying, hey, the New York Times is looking to do a piece. How do you feel about talking to a journalist and like having a couple pictures taken? You've always wanted to work in Hawaii. The two friends who met in Green Bay wish all their fellow healthcare workers could get the same personal recognition. I feel like all I did was go to work and I'm lucky because I have a job and I do something I love. And it, it didn't feel like anything other than what I was going to do for the rest of my life anyway. <laughs> but Cotolo and Fitzsimmons feel lucky to represent the experiences of workers in Green Bay and around the country. Obviously, I think everyone is giving recognition um, with, to all healthcare workers, which is amazing. Um, it, I just wish I could share that, like the recognition with everyone that I have whose path I've crossed and I've worked with. The nurses have bonded in their experiences, even eating Thanksgiving dinner together away from their families, but they've had tough times in Green Bay. This was, honestly, I think when we took this, this was the most hurting um, on our travel site. Like it seemed like it was the most hurting hospital at the time of when we accepted. As well as the country, they hope to make a mark on Northeast Wisconsin. That I hope there's an end in sight with Absolutely. the vaccine. One of my favorite sayings is, uh, is uh, leave people better than you found them. And that is something I hope, I hope we were able to give the nurses here and staff here a break so that they didn't have to do so many call-in shifts. So would you guys say you're friends for life now? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. In Green Bay, Ben Boken, NBC 26.